Hi, uh, welcome to my uh, DSD uh, class, and uh, we are going to deliver the material of the course online um, for the uh, time being. Um, in terms of the course material, we are doing very well. In fact, uh, we have uh, uh, extra uh, lectures that we can spend on the project. And uh, because I received questions regarding the project, I'm going to spend this lecture on the, uh, let's say the assignment, actually, uh, which was uh, delivered prior to the um, uh, uh, time off that we are taking. Okay, so basically, um, to answer those questions regarding the assignment, the idea is um, we have a system of functions, uh, for example, the one you see in front of you, and these functions, they interconnect via uh, communication links, and every con communication, links, uh, communi communication link has a weight. For instance, between A and F, there is a weight of 1. This is a cost function. And in this case, what we want to do is to partition the system into two sets, or one for software and one for hardware. The, the set for the software can include one or more nodes. You have at least to have one set of software. The hardware set can be one hardware set, can be two hardware sets, can be three hardware sets, can be zero hardware set. For example, you can have all the functions mapped to software set. And in this case, you wouldn't have any hardware set. When you map a function um, to, or when you map those functions to any partitioning, you are supposed to compute a metric function, which is the one in front of us right here. This is the metric function. And the metric function is the ratio between cost and speed up, and the cost adds up the link weights and the area. Let's just go over those rules that, that, that dictates the, the area for the hardware and the software. In terms of the single software set that you must have, you can have only one and one only uh, software set. The area of this set is zero because we are going to ignore the code size. The speed up of the features that are mapped to the hardware to the software set is one, meaning no speed up. Internal links between the software set are counted in this function. And in terms of the hardware sets, which you can have none or one set or two sets or how many sets you want, uh, internal links in a single hardware set are ignored, okay, inside the hardware set. Which means, for example, um, let's say, for instance, you have here, I'm going to go over this let's say for example you have two hardware sets this is a hardware set and this is a hardware set okay let's say uh, you partitions your system as such this is the software set and this is a, a hardware set uh, uh, one and hardware uh, set uh, two and this is uh, a b c b uh, e f for example um, the communication links between a single hardware set are ignored. You don't add them, okay? But the communication links inside the software set, they are added. The area here is computed as you count one node, two node. This, the area here is computed as two to the two. Plus the area here, you have two nodes, 2 to the 2 square. Okay? And here, since it's a software, you ignore the area, so plus 0. 
okay so the area uh, the total weight for the area will be 4 plus 4 and equals 8 okay so this is just an explanation of how this work and finally the speed up consists of every feature of those a or b if it is mapped to software then there is no speed up and if it is mapped to hardware then there is the speed up and obviously every function of those has a fraction of time let's just say for example uh, uh, f here um, a, a, f, uh, let's say for example it takes 20 percent of the simulation time and when we move it to hardware it is speed up by eight so this is the speed up of this feature so as we've learned in the class we add those with this with this uh, uh, speed up function as as such now the goal of this project is to find the partition with the minimum metric okay let's take a full-fledged example here and, and 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 this is the example that i gave here uh in in one of the cases so um let's see here if we go to a new okay so okay so let's let's draw the 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 the, the figure here um see um we have um we have node a and f and b and c and d and e okay and a weight of one between a and f and a weight of three between uh, uh, c and, 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 and f and a weight of two between b and c and a weight of four between c and d and a weight of three between d and e okay that's the figure that you are giving so now basically the metric that we are trying to compute here let me split my screen here for to do better so the metric equals the summation of links plus summation of area square divided by the speed up okay so this is area square so let's say for example here let's start with the uh, links okay so let's change color here and let's use uh, red for links and the summation uh, so for links let's see links equal well um, clearly we can do the metric before we assume certain uh, 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 partitioning so let's say for example we are we are doing this partition where we map um, C D and E to software set and only one software set <laughs> and A B and F to hardware set one single hardware set I, I can have zero hardware sets I can have one hardware set I can have two hardware set etc so in this case the computation of the links um, is as such a three will be computed and two will be computed because they are between the sets so two plus three are there and then <coughs> and then within the hardware set this will be ignored this one is ignored within signal hardware set so i'm not going to add it within software the four and the three will be ca counted four plus three and this will equal to 12. okay so now in terms of area let's see for instance um what we can do in terms of area square area square you know summation of the area square clearly i have here one hardware set which has one two three nodes okay so i'm gonna say three nodes square 
That's it. I don't have any hardware set to count. If I have another hardware set, I'll add the nodes and square them. And this is equal to 9. And now let's talk about the speed up. Okay, so let's uh, uh, take another color here and we'll compute the speed up here. So the speed up equals 1, as we've learned from class, 1 over. Now every feature here has a fraction of time and a speed up should this feature be run uh, on hardware. And in the assignment, you are giving every feature the fraction and the speed up of that feature should that feature be taken to hardware. We will use this to <laughs> these <laughs> fractions and speed up to compute the system speed up. So now, what are the features that we're, that we're taking to hardware? A, B, and F. So A runs 30% of the time with a speed up of 10 because it was taken to hardware. And B runs 25% of the time with a speed up of 8. I'm sorry, 9. And F runs 20% um, of the time with a speed up of 8. And then the rest, C and D and um, uh, C and D and E, they all stay the same, 0 0.05. So, so uh, here, um, this is this is for A, this is for B, this is for F, and this is the rest of C, D, and E because they have not run in, on uh, any speed up. This is equal to 3.01 if you do the math. Now. Let's compute the metric. So the metric now equals, let's choose another color here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so um, the metric here, metric equals, I need the links. So here are the links, 12 plus area. Okay, square, nine. over the system speed up, which is right here, 3.01, I computed, 3.01, okay? And that equals to seven. So for, the, for this particular partitioning right here, the cost equal seven. And your, your, your job, your assignment must search for the minimum, the minimum, I'm sorry, I, sh I should say it here, the, the metric instead of the cost. Oh, that's, let's just back off a little bit. Okay, so, okay, so the metric equals seven. So your assignment is to minimize the metric by trying different partitioning. Now, the super uh, uh, man or women, I should say, uh, are those are going to think of an algorithm. And that's really um, where you will uh, try to uh, uh, go fast to the, to, to the solution. Now, here are the questions, another questions that I received. How many nodes that I will be given here? Am I stuck with, uh, do I have the same A, B, C, D? No, no, of course, in the, in the testing, you can have uh, many nodes. But let, let me let's just say, uh, Let's not go over uh, board with this and, 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 and become crazy about how many number of nodes because if you make them unlimited, then the problem becomes very hard. Let's just say we are looking at around 10 nodes, basically. Um, and, 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 and the other question that I received, can, can we change those weights and, and, and speed ups? Of course, of course, the, the, they can be changed because when you read this input file right here, this input file, this input file can change, right? I can change it and, and, and this leads to a different partition. So these are the parameters for your, for your program and those parameters will dictate the optimum solution. If those parameters 
change the optimum solution change okay uh, i hope that clarifies the assignment for you um and i uh, uh, look for um uh, all your questions um probably we can assign an interactive session if uh, need be and answer any further question but i i i want to just uh, clarify the computation of the metric that we are trying to optimize and some of the assumptions about the partitions and good luck in your program um uh, the question about the deadline just keep uh, checking on uh, moodle um and i will post any updates for the assignment deadline if there is any okay thank you very much